Globetom baby. <laughs> As you can all see, I'm looking very expired to say the least. Like, I genuinely look like my shelf life was overdue six months ago. Crusty, dusty, musty, but a little bit busty. So, yeah, I'm pretty long overdue a glow up to say the least. Like, I have just not been taking any pride in my appearance. I've not been doing any maintenance literally not for about like a month that is why i look like this so yeah that's what that's what we're gonna be doing today everyone yes 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 Woo! my hair has genuinely got so much hair strain in it right now i feel like the camera's not picking up how bad it actually is but my hair when you go like this it literally feels like chipsticks like just long chipsticks growing from my scrap oh that was why actually Ugh. pretend i never said that um well, it's, it's just not the greatest. It's not really great today, sadly. Um, so, yeah, let's glow up. Woo! So, um, task number one on today's glow up is getting a shower, doing a full body shave, and you bet with baby oil. Yep. Gonna use baby oil. Um, normally, like, nine times out of ten, I literally just use water. And we're back in the room. Put your hands up if you think I look clean. If you didn't put your hands up, you're a goddamn weirdo. Although I'm looking pretty clean and fresh, if I do say so myself, my skin is literally feeling like so like dried out right now. It literally feels just like, it's not really nice to be honest. It's not a nice feeling. Like why me? God, why me? It's because I'm gay that you chose me to give dry skin to. So I'm actually going to do a face mask to take the dryness away. I used to, oh, I hate putting face masks on and they get all over your hands. I used to have a little like brush that I'd put this on with, but because I haven't done skincare in that long or like taking care of myself, God knows where that is at the minute. I never know when to stop with a face mask. Like, was I okay to just quit it then? Or like, do I need to keep, like, keep on going? So when I was in the shower, I used a little colour tone for shampoo, um, cause we're doing a glow up. So like, gotta get that colour back intact as well. Another one of my fatal flaws is literally having dry hair. Like obviously, I know when you dye your hair, it's obviously gonna be like drier. But like, oh, honest to God, my hair is just constantly like. Mm. Do you know what? I just don't know how to dry my hair properly. Like, I do, but like I feel like every single dry ruins it so much more than it was before like i'm just i'm not talented in the hair sector if i'm honest so i'm like lathering my hair with all kinds of products that i don't know what used to actually have but i'm just hoping that to make my hair look quite nice is anyone else by the way so friggin excited for spooky season like it's genuine this is a constant battle in my head is it my favorite time of year or is christmas or summer my favorite time of year because i genuinely like, because if I was to say Halloween was my favourite, I'm like, oh, no, but this in summer. Oh, but no, this is in Christmas. Like, I genuinely can just never, ever pick a favourite. And I'm like that all the time with, like, films, music, people go, what's your favourite? I'm like, I genuinely have so many favourites. Like, I genuinely can't pick. To put it short, I am really, really excited for spooky season. Like, it just gets you so, like, 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 warm and fuzzy inside, but also, like, spooked as well. Love it. Oh, my God. Who knew that washing a face mask off was so much friggin' trouble? Like, I am drenched, like, my arms are drenched, like, I just feel, like, soggy and, like, ugh, horrible, hated every minute of it, never washed my face mask off, again. I have majorly slacked on my teeth care lately, like, my teeth used to be gleaming, like, I, I was proud to say my teeth were really nice, but obviously they're not awful, but oh my god, I can see a difference, like, my teeth used to be, like, really, really white, especially when I come on camera, but now... So, today is my mission. I'm marking today that I'm going to carry on with teeth whitening. And I've said it in this vlog now, so I'm going to have to stick to him. Updates? I actually didn't. But I did start again today, so all is okay. But let me put you on to some really bomb-ass teeth whitening toothpaste. It is literally so good. Like, I genuinely see results, like, after one use of using it. Um, so, 
I'll go and show you it now, but let me show you it. They're before. And this is the after. Don't know if you can see it on camera or not, but trust me, that, that shit is good. Here she is. My tubes, like, battered and tatty. Um, so ignore that, but oh my god, genuinely so good. Now I'm going to use a little teeth whitening strip, because I am so ready to be gleaming. Like, you're not going to even know who I am after this video. Like, you're going to be so shocked. I found it so hard to put these strips on, because you've got to, like, dry your teeth and then do it. But, oh my god, my mouth is non-stop water, and, like, wipe it, wet again. Ah! I'm gonna be talking to Vietnam in this video. Um, I really hope I didn't annoy you. Yeah. Now it is time, the girlies and the guyleys, to get serious because I've been having this ongoing questioning, debate, what I should do basically for a while now. So I've been growing a monobrow out and my whole eyebrows out just because, like, I wanted to, but just wanted them more like messy and just like monstrous basically. But now I'm thinking. I want to glow up, like, I want to feel more, like, clean, cut, fresh, sharp looking. But then also as well, I feel like I'm going to miss the messy look. Do you know what? Fuck it. Fuck it, I am going to get rid of the monobrow. I'm actually really nervous to do this, you know, because, one, this wax is, like, super, super, super hot, and I don't know how long I was even meant to microwave before, let alone cool it down, and I don't really want to burn my face. Um, But also, I've got, like, the shakiest hands ever, and, like, one slight move will just... <laughs> Whip, like rip these off and I really don't want to fuck them up. Uh, I'm scared. Oh my god. That was underwhelming and slightly embarrassing. Oh my god. Why? One tiny hair came off. Oh my god. I actually have a bit of a like funny but scary story time behind this wax. So you see the way that's like fully burned in the middle. So I was drunk and I thought I'll do my eyebrows um and basically i put this in the microwave and i think it's only meant to go in either for like 10 seconds or like 30 seconds i can't remember which one the actual time is but anyway i kept it in for like a minute or two minutes something like around that time anyway and it smelled like burn and i was like oh shit like me wax oh my god and i opened the microwave and it's just like smoke came out and i was like oh my god i've just genuinely nearly set this apartment block on fire like scary my life flashed before my eyes and ladies and gentlemen don't leave wax in a microwave unattended because you will nearly end up like me oh my god oh my god oh my god i have just nearly died that was all pushed together like that and look i had no eyebrow left but i realized like i've just got to push them back and like this will lay Oh my god, that was scary. The monobrow is well and truly gone. I feel like my eyebrows feel like they look so much more far apart, like they're not. But with it gone, it does. I I'm looking very smooth in the middle. Just took my teeth whitening off too. Feeling pearly white. Apparently doing skincare and like makeup and stuff after waxing is really, really not advised. But I've got a glow up I need to finish. Girl, don't do it. I'm not going to do it, girl. I am going to do it, to be honest. I really am going to do it because we don't have all day and, like, I need to glow up. I actually haven't used this moisturiser in ages. I remember last time, my skin was a little bit sensitive to it. Maybe I shouldn't use this while wax. Mm. I'm going to do it. Okay, I'm going to do it. It is time for the real glow up now because I'm going to do makeup. Just watch this space. Watch how friggin' banging. I'm gonna look in a minute. So my camera very, very rude. The Lee interrupted me and cut out because it needed charging. Um so yeah, I went ahead and curled my hair. Comment down below if you think I look nice and gorgeous. I think I'm gonna just skip to the end glow now because I don't wanna bore you too much of me just basically sat in the same frame for about like, I don't know what, 10, 20 minutes. So yeah, let's skip to the glow up. Ladies and gentlemen, hair. I'm back. Best than ever and feeling really great. Not gonna lie, I am feeling like I have my shit together. And I mean together, like painted my nails, 
the lot. Also as well, paint, mm, really annoying. Painted my nails, literally waited about 15 minutes for them to dry. Then I was like, right, need to go and find some lipstick. So I went to get some lipstick and then literally straight away chipped this nail. Like, why can't I ever have anything nice? <laughs> it literally looks like someone was about to shoot me. For the laugh, I've got a new least life of me after that glow. That was my glow up, feeling pretty glowing up to fuck. Um, thanks for hanging out with me today. It's been super fun and I'll see you next week.